Mudkip may use fire type moves, but it's one cool cat. Okay, so first of all, Mudkip is not fire type Kukui. You call yourself a professor? Oh my goodness, what are you doing with your life? Second of all, Mudkip is more like, I don't know, like a tadpole kind of thing, not a cat. Hey there, brother! Good afternoon! So the day has finally come that you're moving to Alola! Is that racist? I feel like that was a little racist. <laughs> Let's give a little bit more of a easy to remember voice. <clears throat> Alola is a region made up of several islands. That could be the reason the region is chock full of nothing but rare Pokemon, yeah? There's no shortage of cool Pokemon out here in Alola either. Such mysterious creatures. You find them all over. In the grass, in the caves, in the sky and sea. Here in Alola, we love our Pokemon, and we depend on them. Heaps, too. Some of us even battle with them, if we call ourselves Pokemon trainers. Rockruff, Cutiefla, I'll play with you later, so cool your jets. Alright, I gotta ask you some questions about yourself so I can introduce you to everybody. So which... I almost said... <laughs> So which potato should I use for your trainer passport? That's what I thought I said. I thought I said potato. Dang it, dude. So which photo should I use for your trainer passport? Uh, let's see. I mean... I don't know. <sighs> this one? Are you okay with the one you chose, yeah? I mean, it is what I look like, so I guess I'm okay with it. I mean... It's the card I was dealt. Alright then, I'll let you spell out your name for me. Oh, this is gonna be easy. Derry. And we are playing this on Citra. I know, I know. I do own the game, I have 3DS and all that stuff, but I wanted to do a randomizer and I couldn't quite figure out how to get it to work. So you go by Derry and answer. I do, yes. I know, it's a weird name. It's a uh, European, I believe, in origin. Tenfold, good buddy. I'll let everybody out here know you're on your way. Thank you. I appreciate that. Derudansa? I mean, you're a little late on the name. Yeah, that's a name that hits you like a trop. Trop kick right to the head. Woo! Alright, I'm gonna need you to calm down. Can't wait to see you in person then, cousin. Oh, that was pretty... That was pretty rough. That was pretty rough, Kukui. Dare an answer? Come help me with these boxes. That's my mama. Gotta go. Gotta go help my mama. Get this mouse out of the way. Oh, footsteps. What you doing, girl? You running? You look like you're running. Oh, you're hoofing it. That guy looks angry. Ro oh! Watch out for the Power Ranger villain. Zzz. Looks like there's two of them. Yep, there's two of them. Oh, they look creepy. What is this? Some ICP th flashbacks? Look at that sun. Ultra sun, baby! Whoa! Yeah! I'm so excited. Let's do this. Day one, episode one, part one. How are you guys doing? I hope you're excited. Oh, I just dropped my controller. I'm using a PS4 controller because I'm ghetto like that. Look at that map. What a beautiful, what a beautiful place. I live here. Dude, I just moved here from, I think we're from Japan in the Pokemon world. I don't know. I'm so excited. It's a beautiful place. I've never actually played uh, Sun or Moon or Ultra Sun or Moon. I own them. I just haven't had time. And I figured... Might as well randomize it and have a good, good let's play with it. Can I skip this? I don't care, dude. I don't. Look at that. I don't care. Mom. Mom. Go away. Ah, oh, can't you just feel that warmth? The first day spent under a Lola sun. It's so warm and bright here. But that's enough of that. Time to unpack all these boxes. Meow, go get Derry to answer for me, would ya? Meow. I don't know why Mom said meow to you, Meow. Meow, Heather, covered. 
dang, what a nice room. Look at that TV! I didn't have a TV like that when I was a kid. Is that a Pikachu doll? I didn't have a Pikachu doll when I was a kid. It's bullshit. Actually, I had a Pikachu action figure. Does that count? That doesn't count. I didn't get to sleep and cuddle with it. Get out of bed here. Oh, stretch. He didn't stretch, dude. We're just going to go ahead and save right away. All right, Mom! I'm hungry! Give me some food, Mama! You were out like a light, weren't you? You ought to be full of energy by now. And just look, it's already daytime here. It's completely the opposite of Kanto, but then we are so far away here in Alola. So, dear answer, are you excited to meet some Alolan Pokemon? Uh, yeah, of course. It's the whole reason I decided to come with you instead of living with Dad in his sweet luxury house. That's right. I want to hurry up and meet some, too. We're living in the Alola region now, the beautiful islands everyone wants to visit. I'm sure the Pokemon living in a place like this must be friendly, right? It might not be a bad idea to go out and see for yourself just how friendly Pokemon here are. Right, Dariusa? Go and get her... Oh, <laughs> sorry. <coughs> Slipped up there. Uh, right there, Dancer. Go and get ready for a bit of exploring. Your bag and hat and things should be hanging on your coat stand in your room. And didn't you leave your copy of Adventure Rules on your desk, too? I did. You're right. You're right. I did not get ready at all. I'm just a punk kid. Look at this walk. Huh, huh, huh. I'm gonna join the army. Perfect posture. Look at this. Look at this swag, dude. You jealous, Meowth? You want some of this? Meow. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Alrighty, let's see, let's look around here. It's a game console you can even take outside and play. Oh, it's a Nintendo Switch, that's kind of cool. Advertising. Even a tiny globe like this one, Kanto and Alola seem awfully far apart. You're right, it was quite the train... train? <laughs> it's quite the plane ride over. Can I get back? Can I go back? Oh, I can. Yes! Alright, thank you guys for watching this Let's Play. Uh, this has been Dairy Dancer. I love your face. Yada yada yada. Subscribe. I'm just going to finish the game here. The scent is somehow oddly comforting. I agree. Whenever I get in my bed, ooh. Now you look ready for anything. Thanks, Mom. You're the best. I know. I'm sexy and I know it. Oh, but even s Oh. <coughs> Sorry. Oh, but even so, Dairy Dancer, try to be careful walking through all the tall grass. Still, I have to admit that I'd love to have a new Pokemon around. Why don't you head up toward Iki Town and see what you discover in Alola? Meow. Thanks, Meowth. Uh, your input's always appreciated. Uh, hate you. Hate you, Meowth. Oh, yep. First steps outside. Dairy Dancer's house. I mean, it's more my mom's house, but thank you, I guess. Uh, nope. Okay, let's see. Have I ever played a Pokemon game before, you think? Uh, yeah. What do you say? You can go with me if you dash with me. What do you think of my song? Uh, keep working on it, I guess. What's in here? Nothing. Whole lot of nothing. What you looking at? Oh! That's cool. Look at that Wingle. Come here, Wingle. What do you say? <coughs> <laughs> like, the power of science is amazing. You can enjoy a festival with people from around the world without even taking a step, bruh. Every day is a festival when you can do that. I mean, you're not wrong. Oh. Something is coming at you from the tall grass. What is it? Oh, no! Yas. <laughs> Okay, what is this thing? Ooh. Mar. Bark, bark. Yah, yas! <laughs> That's a weird. That's a weird. That's a weird thing to do. Yeah. All right, now this is a randomized game, so. <laughs> oh crap! I already forgot his voice. Hey there, cousin. Hi, yuck. Hang on, I know you. You're Dare Dancer, right? You okay? I saw you get kicked 
<laughs> I saw you get attacked like that. Yeah, I got a bit of help. I was scared spitless! <laughs> you and me both, cousin. I'm looking after these Pokemon, but they dash right out on their own to save you. But I guess I'm getting ahead of myself. Welcome to Alola, the Pokemon Paradise. That's what I'm supposed to be saying. Hi, yuck. <laughs> I'm Kukui, yeah! The Pokemon Professor. People and Pokemon work and live together here in Alola, too. Don't you ever forget that. You can go anywhere. Yeah, as long as you got a Pokemon in your corner. Wild Pokemon could be looking in the tall grass. Yeah, just waiting to leap out and bite you. But you'll be fine if you've got a partner of your own. Hey there. Here, let me introduce you to the Pokemon that helped you just now. This is the grass type Pokemon Rowlet. And this is the fire type Pokemon Litten. And this is the water type Pokemon Poplio. Bark. See, the fact of the matter is, one of this Pokemon will become your first partner. Whoa! Here, maybe that's why they wanted to save you. Go on, choose the one you'd like to keep as your partner, cousin. Oh, that was like eight different voices in one. I apologize for my crappy voice acting in advance. Why don't you go ahead and choose the one you'd like to keep as your partner, cousin? Okay, so this is randomized, this is what I was saying. So the starters, we got Torchic, Mudkip, or Bulbasaur. Hmm. Mudkip may use fire-type moves, but it's one cool cat. Okay, so first of all, Mudkip is not fire-type, Kukui. You call yourself a professor? Oh my goodness, what are you doing with your life? Second of all, Mudkip is more like, I don't know, like a tadpole kind of thing, not a cat. So you want to go with fire-type Pokemon Linton? I mean, sure. You and I are just on two different dimensional planes right now. I mean, you're seeing Linton, I'm seeing Mudkip. Oh, that's cute. That's a cute moment. Meow. Yeah. Dude, just kiss it already. Staring long in... You chose Linton. Boom, baby. There's our Mudkip. Uh, yeah, let's give it a nickname. We gotta give him nicknames. Now, I'm not gonna do, like, a Nuzlocke or anything like that, because that sounds complicated and boring. Uh, let's see. Let's go loud. Uh, whoop, burp. Loud, oh, yeah, actually, you know what? Inspiration comes in weird waves, doesn't it? Loud burp. Oh. Can I backspace? No! No! <laughs> Loud Bive, that's your name from now on. Loud Bive. Dang it. Inspiration did not come in a weird way. Dang it. So you went flitting. Woo, what a fine-looking team you two are. Now that you can have Pokemon battles, you're what we call a Pokemon trainer. Here's a Pokeball for Litten too. It should be fe it should feel nice and cozy in there. Just like your mom. Whoa, what was that, Kukui? What were you saying? Alright, then let's get going up to Iki Town. Dirty Dancer, woo! Dirty Dancer, woo! Time to meet the Island Kuna. Island uh what now? But why? Truth is, that partner in Litton of yours is a gift from the Kahuna, not me. So let's go show it off. Say a proper thank you, cuz. It may not be the only gift you get. In case you hadn't heard, the Kahunas are all crazy strong Pokemon trainers. Be careful about getting into a battle with one. Thank you. Thank you, Kukui. I appreciate you as always. You're just so insightful. Iki Town is right up here. I guess we're going to Iki Town. Icky? Icky Town sounds more up to code. Uh, let's see. Get Linton in there, that Pokeball I gave you. Linton, get in this Pokeball. Good boy. Good boy. Or girl, I don't really know which one you are yet. So we're going to go ahead and save right now. That was a, that was a lot of talking. First Pokemon right here, baby. Oh. <gasps> It's a graveler. Loud bive. Dang it, you're supposed to be loud burp. Oh well. 
We can make that work. Actually, Greffler's not too bad. We'll just water gun him. Get some crazy XP. Oh, one shot him? Are you kidding me right now? Randomizers are the best. I love randomizers. It's nice because I can catch all the Pokemons. Like, I don't even know how many there is now. 800 something. I can catch all of them in this randomizer playthrough. So it's going to be, there's going to be a lot to do. It's going to be fun. We'll do some shiny hunting. The only thing that's really been adjusted in this playthrough is, I don't even know. Water gun? Yeah. Uh, the only thing that's been adjusted in this playthrough is the fact that all the Pokemon you run into are randomized. And then also the trainers are going to be a little bit stronger i think i don't know i don't really understand everything that i did to it to be honest with you but uh the only things i really touched are the trainers and the pokemon so should be a hundred percent randomized pokemon run-ins including legendaries um also should be able to run into some random like mega evolutions like perma perma megs that's what i'm gonna call them did i just die oh what is this garbage you scurry back home, protecting your exhausted Pokemon from any further harm. You're a failure as a trainer. You died on your second Pokemon battle. You should probably just give up, dude. Just, it gets a lot tougher from here. We haven't even faced a trial yet. I don't even know if there's gym badges. I, don't, I doubt it. Uh, we, have, oh, we haven't even met a rival yet. Oh, dude, my mom's going to be so disappointed. Jeez, dude, what should I do? I mean, was Mudkip the wrong choice? I could have gotten Torchic, but I don't know. Torchic's kind of... Ah, uh, uh, dude. Welcome home, Dairy Dancer. Looks like that could have gone better, hmm? Well, get some rest before you head out again. <coughs> Loser. Thanks, Mom. I love you, too. That's more like it. Now you and your Pokemon are both bursting with energy. Yay! But you know when your Pokemon run out of energy and their HP starts getting too low. Well, hmm, you'll figure it out, dumb bitch. <laughs> well, it's just common sense for a trainer to go back home and let them recover, okay? Now get out there and have some fun. Thanks, Mom. <sniffs> Meowth! I don't want to hear it! Let's see, so let's take a look at our Pokemon here. We got ourselves a mud kit. Oh, he's holding an Ultra Ball. I will take that. I guess that's one of the other things I adjusted is, um... Pokemon are more likely to have held items, and I also randomized the items that they could be holding, so I think Ultra Ball, well, obviously Ultra Ball is one of them. Uh, let's see, we got Impish Nature, found him on Route 1, Level 5, Strong Willed, Water Type, uh, it seems decent. Special Defense is pretty high, that's good. Special Attack's okay. Normal Attack's really high. Defense is decent, Speed is okay, HP is okay. So I think that's pretty good. Pretty good. What was I saying? I don't even remember. Oh yeah, so held items can be, I think, anything. Uh, so we might even be able to get, like, if we catch a Pokemon, it might even hold a Master Ball. Be holding a Master Ball. Uh, I don't want to hear it, old man. Kukui, screw you. We can win. Oh. <coughs> we can win this. We can win. Just a little bit more. Meowth, you scratch. Snar! Oh, wait. I thought she said snar. Meow! I don't know why I'm talking to people. People are stupid. Trainer tips. Pokemon can gain XP points by battling other Pokemon. Experience points help them grow stronger. And if you catch a Pokemon you're battling against, you get experience points for that, too. I assume is what it said. I didn't quite fully pay attention to that. What do we got here? A cacturn. Go, loud bath. Got all the jive. Ooh, that's grass dark type versus my water ground type. Or just water. He's not ground until later. Ooh, okay, that wasn't bad. As long as this cacturn doesn't know any grass moves, I think we can kill it. Get level 7. Don't poison me. Good. One more! One more hit! 
You got this lot five. Good boy or girl. Good thing. I think that's boy. Yeah, blues boy. Lot five grew to level seven, baby. HP twenty six. I never really pay attention to that stuff. Not bad. Do you know any thunder moves? Because if you do, I might cut you when I get pokeballs. Actually, do I have pokeballs? He said he gave me a pokeball for Linton. Slash Mudkip. That did like nothing. Oh, I've got that Ultra Ball. Mm -hmm. Nah, we'll save it. Ultra Ball, that's going to be really, really, really good. How much is, is Tackle better than Water Gun when it comes to Electric type Pokemon? Let's find out. Inconclusive, because each water gun did about 33% damage, I think. is a fair assumption, maybe about 35. And Tackle KO'd him from that, so inconclusive. I'm going to save real quick. Anywho, before we go any further, because I'm pretty sure once I go over there, I'm going to get some sort of stupid cutscene thing. And I don't know how long this episode's been going on for. But I'm going to end it here. If you want to like it, like it, subscribe, smash that, I don't know, what do people say again? Smash that like button, smash it, you know, whatevs. Um, comment down below if you want to see more of this. I'm actually going to do a few more episodes probably the next few days. Looking forward to it. And yeah, we'll go from there. I love your face. I was looking at my hands instead of paying attention to what my character was doing. Should have had him facing it, but... I love your face. I hope to see you in the next one. Laters!